Hello everyone, my name is Sonar Computer Man, and welcome to a vlog, I guess. So, what's going on right now is that I am at the dentist, and I'm getting my wisdom teeth removed, and you all know what that means on YouTube. Funny stuff's gonna happen. So, I made sure to tell my parents and all that to record me, because why not? And it'll probably be like one of the best things you'll ever see, hopefully. I don't know. So yeah, I'm, I just like got in here and I'm gonna go in there pretty soon and see how all this is gonna go down. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Alright guys, so it has been a week since I got my wisdom teeth removed. And today actually I just got my stitches removed that came along with the wisdom teeth. And I have quite a story to tell you guys. Um, I was trying to record my, uh, I guess after my post-surgery, because, you know, stuff, funny stuff always happens when someone gets their wisdom teeth removed. Not really this time, no. Um, it was weird. Okay, I went in, they didn't allow cameras in there so no one could record, and you know, they strapped the put the gas mask on me for the anesthesia, you know, next thing you know, I'm out, I'm asleep. But, I didn't stay asleep. What happened was, I was in the chair, I couldn't see anything. They had some sort of mask on me that covered my eyes up. I couldn't really tell what it was, it was like yellowy white. But, I woke up during the surgery. It was, it was like weird, like awful. They said that they, the anesthesia that they used is, is to make you forget in case you do wake up like that. Because apparently it's sort of common. But obviously I remember. I was in the chair. I woke up, I couldn't really see anything, and I just felt piercing in my mouth. I just, I just felt the pain of it. I don't know what, I don't know how long I was awake, I don't know how many times I woke up, but I remember it, uh, I woke up a couple times, or it was just one constant time near the end. Because I remember them, they were piercing me, and I would say, I wouldn't say anything actually, I would just, I wouldn't scream, but I would like groan in pain. And I remember the doctor saying, um, Oswaldi, please don't make that noise. And um, try not to be, try not to make so much noise, try to be quiet, you know, stuff like that. And I also remember there was this point where I needed a cough during the surgery. So I was coughing and they were like, just let, just let it out. Just keep coughing. That's good. Keep doing that. And it was just, I don't know. It was kind of emotional. Because the anesthesia just messes with your head, and they even said that it just makes you, like, emotional sometimes. And they took me, after the surgery, they put me in this bed to lay in for a little while. And I was laying in the bed, and then my parents were able to come in, they recorded some footage. Uh, nothing too much, because nothing funny happened. It was just me sitting there. And... They, I heard the nurse, or whatever you want to call them, the dentist, whatever, I heard them saying that, oh, he probably won't even remember this room or anything that happened after this. Just take him home. Obviously, I remember, because I'm telling you right now. 
And so I'm just sitting there and I'm like, I'm going to remember because you just, I don't know how, but you just know you're going to remember something because it's so vivid. And that happened. I'm not making this up. I didn't dream it. I didn't, I didn't just like hallucinate. I remember this exactly. I was, I woke up during the surgery. Like, how does that happen? And the fact that they said I would forget about it, that's the reason they put me on the anesthesia, to forget about it. Then it starts, like, I remember it. I, I remember all of that. I didn't forget. Like, what the heck? I'm sure the anesthesia helped with the pain a little bit, I'm pretty sure, because when the anesthesia started wearing off, my head was hurting, and oh my god, it was just awful. So yeah, after that, for the first, like, two days, I had to keep gauze in my mouth, and it was bleeding a lot, because obviously that's what happened. And then after those two days, it was sort of, eh, it was aching. The more I talk, the more it aches, and it's really bad, especially because I have to go to school now. And talking, obviously, is a big part of school. I got my stitches removed today, like I said in the beginning of the video. And it was really weird. I walked in, took some weird scissor things, and just cut all of them. I got three stitches on this side and one on every other. Because I got all four teeth removed, and it was awful. The stitches, they weren't that bad. Just went in, went out, it's all good. But it was, it was pretty bad. It was a bit, pretty bad experience. I would not recommend it. Try not to get your wisdom teeth out for as long as you can because it is awful. Uh, I still can't eat solid foods. It's like pudding, applesauce, water and stuff. Like every day, can't really chew a lot. Um, it's, not, it's not the best experience, in my opinion. But I'm getting through it. I'm getting there. So, yeah, that's all I really have to say. Just sharing you the experience I had at the dentist. Not naming names because obviously that could be bad. But I woke up during the surgery. I don't know when throughout the surgery. I think it was the end because maybe the piercing were when they were putting the stitches in. I'm not sure. I don't really care that much because like it's done what am I gonna do about it I don't know but it was painful I just have to tell you guys because I was recording vlogging the whole thing and that's all I really gotta say so I guess thank you for watching this weird strange vlog um yeah so I'll see you guys in the next one take care everyone